this is a video regarding the ANC software in that we will solve first three problems such as a stress problem beam problem and plate problem so first of all we will take a stress problem you can see this is a problem of uh, Pune University Mechanical Engineering CAD CAM practical so this is a stress problem with first of all reference structural um, okay preprocessor element type add element add link we will take a single link and close real constant add add ok in that the cross section area cross section area is given in problem 1 to 5 0 mm square for first link so 1 to is minimum window 1 to 5 0 ok in problem there are two areas so again select add link 1 you can see the uh, element set number reference number 2 area 2 triple 0 triple zero and on screen ok then set one set two is set so close window next is a material properties material models in material models the structural linear elastic isotropic in that the young's modulus poison ratio there are two values also given in a problem you can see 2.1 e raised to 5 means modulus 2.1 e raised to e raised to 5 poison's ratio is standard 0.3 if it is not is given in problem take a 0.3 as a standard next is metal new model second model define metal for second model isotropic Second is Young's modulus 2.1 e raised to 5. Poison's ratio 0.3. This is the standard value. Okay. So two material are set. Then close the end. Next is modeling. In that we will design a structure as per given in problem. Create key points on inactive series. First of all, we will take as a reference point as a 1, take a 0, 0, 0 in all axis. We will start from the F point, so we will take a F as a reference point. So all dimensions in 3 axis is 0, 0, 0. So we will take a all problem 0. So 0 in X axis, Y axis also 0, Z axis also 0. So this is our first reference point. All the dimension we will give from the reference point. Second problem, second point is a second number. So, so second is second is uh, E point. You can see the x in x axis 1.5 mm meter. Sorry, and y axis is zero, and z axis is also zero. Second point, x axis 1.5 zero z axis is zero y axis is zero apply third point third point point is a d point you can see the x axis is 1.5 plus 3 it's 4.5 meter and y x y axis is zero and z axis is also zero y axis is zero z axis is zero next is four Fourth point is C point. We can see the in x axis the dimension is 1.5 3 plus 1.5. So we will take 3 3 plus 3 6 6 meter in x axis and y axis is also given is 2 meter. So in x axis 6 double 0 sorry triple 0 and y axis 2 mm 2 meter so it's 2 
ट्रिपल जीरो इन जेड एक्सेस इज जीरो सो आपला फोर्थ पॉइंट नेक्स्ट पॉइंट इज फिफ्थ पॉइंट यू कैन सी इन प्रॉब्लम फिफ्थ पॉइंट डायमेंशन फिफ्थ पॉइंट इज बी पॉइंट इन एक्स एक्सिस इज वन पॉइंट फाइव प्लस वन पॉइंट फाइव इज थ्री एम एम थ्री मीटर एंड वाई एक्सिस इज टू एम एम हाइट ओके सो इन एक्स एक्सिस एक्स डायरेक्शन इज थ्री मीटर दैट इज थ्री हंड्रेड एम एम वाई एक्सिस इज टू हंड्रेड एम एम जेड एक्सिस इज जीरो ओके आपला नेक्स्ट पॉइंट इज सिक्स पॉइंट सिक्स पॉइंट वी कैन सी इन प्रॉब्लम द एक्स एक्सिस इज जीरो वाई एक्सिस इज टू टू एम एम दैट इज टू हंड्रेड एम एम सो एक्स नेक्स्ट एक्सिस इज सिक्स एक्सिस पॉइंट एज इन डायमेंशन इज इन एक्स एक्स इज जीरो एंड वाई एक्सिस हाइट इज टू हंड्रेड एम एम सो इन दिस वे वी विल फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल गिव द की पॉइंट नेक्स्ट इज वी विल जॉइन द ऑल की पॉइंट बाय लाइन्स लाइन्स स्ट्रेट लाइन्स सो पिक ऑफ ऑल एज लाइन्स एज पर प्रॉब्लम सी प्रॉब्लम इन दैट जॉइंट एफ टू ई ई टू डी फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल डी टू सी यू कैन यू कैन जॉइन द इनी एनी सिक्वेंस दैट विल नॉट अ मैटर ओके इन दिस वे वी विल जॉइन द ऑल लाइन्स एज पर गिवन स्ट्रक्चर नेक्स्ट नेक्स्ट इज नेक्स्ट इज इम्पॉर्टेंट पॉइंट दैट मेशिंग इन दैट मेशिंग मेशिंग एट्रीब्यूट्स पिक लाइन्स यू कैन सी द हॉरिजोंटल लाइन देर आर टू एरिया फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू विल सिलेक्ट द ओनली हॉरिजोंटल लाइन्स So only take the horizontal lines. First of all, you select the horizontal lines. Okay. Okay. Next is link one. Link one. Set one. Okay. Pick second line. That is horizontal vertical lines. You can see there are two areas. So vertical lines are now. So you will select the vertical line. Okay. Here select two as a link. Material number is also two. And types of element type is link one. That only the you have to change the second point, second link. Okay, done. Next to select line, line set, set line. Okay, pick all lines. In that pick all lines. One. Number of element divisions we will select one. Okay. Then also minimize window that. In that. Mesh. Here is also second is pick all lines. You can see the blue color line that indicate that your meshing is done. Next is define load. As per given problem, we will define loads. In that you can see at a EF, A and E point, the load that is displacement load. In B point, there are in y axis two kilonewton. At C point, y axis is one kilonewton. So first of all, we will give load deflection load. First of all, define load, apply load, 
structural displacement in displacement load on key points first of all select the key points where the deflection load is given in problem there are two points a and f okay. all degree of freedom in displacement all degree of freedom all motions are restricted next is force movement in that we will define the load on key points in diagram at a at a b point you can see the uh, in y axis 2 km in the, the y axis we will take a negative direction so we will take first of all point fy select fy in that the load is in negative direction so we will take a negative load that is a 2000 okay then apply next point is c point select select the c point okay in also a y direction 1 km in negative direction that is y direction so 1000 minus 1000 meter so you can see The load is given. That is two kilonewton and one kilonewton. Next is you check the problem. This all dimension, all load is we will we complete all the dimensions all load. Next is the solution. In solution, we will solve the problem. Next is solve solve current LS. You can see there is a window solve current load steps. So select OK. You can see over here the solution is done. That is that you window indicate your problem or your solution or result is done. So we will select. We will see the one by one result. Now, now the general post post procedure in that plot plot results plot results deform shapes. We will select deform plus undeform shape. OK. It will show you the deformed plus undeformed shape. So dark blue color indicate the undeformed shape, and yellow indicate the undeformed shape. Next is the vector plot. Sorry, counter plot. In that, the nodal solution. You can see all the results is present over here. All degree of solution stresses. First of all, you will see the stresses. Displacement vector. Okay, displacement vector. But first of all, you will see. In that you can see the maximum stress indicated at the yellow point, sorry, uh, at the red point. That indicate the there is a maximum stress. Next is least result. Stress. Nodal solution. Stresses. X y stresses. Most of the in problem the x y stresses is. You have to find. You can see the x y stresses value is 0.310127. This is a displacement. So in this way we solve this all the problem. You can you can also plot the all the result. Just select the uh, result and nodal solutions. These are the. In this way the we solve the stress problem. Next problem is we will solve the beam problem or plate problem. Thank you very much.